Hi, I'm Ian Tomaszczyk. I'm 6'2", and I'm reading for the role of Dr. Falcoff. <clears throat> My Bubby and Zyda changed their name from Bagel Bird to Bagel Wasp to escape persecution. And this was mid-Eastern European exodus, so I mean, if I'm really being honest, I've been living a double life since before I was born. But I don't really see what his grandparents changing the family name has to do with him having sex with a stranger behind my back. Uh, we weren't strangers when we met. It has to do with everything. They didn't put my Zyda in the concentration camp like the other Jews because he had false papers ready-made before the war. He was always hedging his bets. He had to lie to survive. Wow. So, it sounds like... unpacking that. I think we're getting somewhere. <laughs> well, I guess, Sarah, what I'm saying is I was with Ophelia because I didn't want to lose you, and if I lost you, I didn't want to be alone. Right. Um, Zach, I appreciate your honesty, but you really hurt me. I don't know if I can trust you anymore. I want to, but... Dr. Faku, can, what can we do to rebuild trust? Well, trust is like a jar you fill with change. And right now, you're hurt because Zach emptied that jar to woo another woman, Ophelia, who graciously agreed to join us today. When you said dinner, you meant like app entree dessert, right? And you have every right to be upset, Sarah. Every right. But I have a question for all three of you. Zach, are you ready to refill that jar of change with your partner, Sarah? Even if it takes any Andy. You bet your ass I am, Doc. I want us to have a full jar, babe, brimming with coins. Me too. Huh. And Sarah, can you trust Zach to refill your jar? 